Hey what's up guys welcome to find gap youtube channel and in today's video i'm going to show you the naming techniques in programming do you know in programming you cannot give a variable name like this total space student space marks this is not allowed because in programming language you cannot put empty spaces between your variables so what's the solution so here we have four naming techniques by using these techniques you can write this variable name without adding spaces between them so the first one is camel case the second one is snake case pascal case and the kebab case so in camel case if you want to write total students marks you will type total in lower case and your second word is students you will type the first letter of this word which is s in upper case and the remaining letters will remain in lower case similarly the first letter of this word marks will be written in uppercase and the remaining letters will be written in lowercase and so on so this is called camel case technique by using this you can name your variables easily and you can see that this is a readable form you can read it easily that what it has written like total student marks and the second technique is snake case in snake case you will write your this variable like this total underscore students underscore marks we use underscore in the place of empty spaces so you can see that we have not used any empty space and still our variable name is readable so we call this case snake case in php we mostly name our variables like this and this is one of the most popular technique to name your variables you can use this technique to create functions and variables as well and the next technique is pascal case in pascal case you write the first letter of your each word in uppercase like you can see uh, when we make android apps we name our java file names in pascal case so this is also one of the most important technique that programmers use in programming to give name their java classes their variables and their functions as well and the next technique is kebab case uh, basically in kebab case we use dash in the place of empty spaces but most programming languages did not allow to use kebab case but you can use the kebab case techniques to name your files like if i'm working on a php project i can give my file name total student.php so i can use hyphen and by using this technique maybe you can make your web pages more seo friendly so friends i hope this information was helpful and if you have any question you can ask us in the comment section we will try to answer your question and please subscribe to our youtube channel to stay updated with amazing programming videos and finally thanks for watching